Hands up for the go-getters. The ambitionless appears they should know better. No better we What's going on, everyone? My name is Upset Cuban, otherwise known as Mr. Cabano, and today I'm bringing as a MW3 gameplay, because, you know, I haven't put any gameplays up from MW3 in a while, and I was just like, man, I actually had fun with this game, so why don't we put it up? And then show you guys my experience. Yeah, I know. I don't really post MW3 gameplays because I think it's totes awk, you know, to put MW3 gameplay even though the game sucks and I don't like it at all. You know, it's totes awk, man. Totes awk. Fuck totes awk. Totes awk suck. I don't know what I'm saying. I'm fucking weird right now. I'm kind of, kind of messed up. <laughs> Anyways, guys. <clears throat> Whoa, throat got congested there. Anyways, guys. Today I'm gonna be talking about something. Nah. You know, kind of not bothers me, but I've always wanted to speak about, and today I get the chance to do it. And it's the struggles as a small YouTuber. Um, now, you guys are probably thinking, oh, I'm not a small YouTuber. I have 1,500 subscribers. Well, I, compared to other people, I am a small YouTuber. But remember, guys, two months ago, I had 200 subscribers. So I know how it feels to be down there. I know how it feels to be below than everyone. You know what I mean? I, I, know, how to fe I know how it feels. And... Honestly, guys, the feeling sucks. It really sucks. It sucks as, you know, everyone that, you know, were in my 200 subscribers count always told me, man, you're a great commentator, man. You got this. You got potential, man. You got this. You're going to get big, you know, but nothing ever happens. And it's kind of frustrating when that happens. And not just to me, guys. You know, I always compare everything to me. I want you guys to understand that it happens to you. It really, really sucks. You know, it sucks because there's people out there with 500,000 subscribers that they don't brag, but they love to show the money they get from this off. You know, they show the experiences. They you know they get to play paintball with subscribers. They get to show all these experiences off. And then you see that as a small YouTuber, and then you're just like, oh, man. Like, you know, that kind of puts you down. That kind of puts your self-esteem it just lowers it pretty much because you see all these guys and you're just like, yeah, man, I make all this money and you know what I mean? And they don't say like you don't make money, but then you're like, I don't make money from this and I'm trying extra, extra hard to get somewhere without even making money. You know what I mean? So there's the top guys that are kind of pushing you down and kind of squeezing you all together. And then there's the, I guess, mental part of it where the people hate on you or you try to your best to make a video and then the video turns on you and you gets disliked or you know, people disliking your videos, or just not getting enough views, you know? And that's my problem, is not getting enough views. I mean, I'm getting like 200 views a video, but I usually rank around 400, 500 on the day the sub boxes actually work. You know, my last two videos, they got around 20 to 30 likes, when my videos usually average around 60 to 70 likes. You know, and that kind of makes me upset. That makes me a terribly an upset Cuban. Haha, <laughs> see what I did there? You know, to see that you put so much hard work into a video and then it gets turned around and disliked or not enough views or you know people didn't like it or not enough people have seen it it gets really really frustrating you know these big guys don't have to worry about that you know guys with 25k and up they don't have to worry about that because you know as soon as they upload a video bam 301 views in a in like five minutes you know what i mean you know, they already get like 500 likes before the video is not even like stopped being video locked. And it's ridiculous how what makes me mad the most is how it's ridiculous how the top guys kind of push down the little guys. You know, when I mean top guys, I mean like big, big motherfuckers like 500,000, 800,000, 1 million, around like the, you know, 100Ks area. They All they do is they show these great things, you know, and it's a great thing, you know, I'm not bashing on any good commentators in the freaking tops and you know I'm not com I'm not bashing them I'm just saying how it's kind of it kind of sucks how they kind of flaunt what they have you know they kind of show off the money they have they kind of show off all the things they do because of their great YouTube channel and then there's people not just me guys but there's other people out there that I know them Jelly Turtles, Mr. T, Little Brahachi, Captain Obvious, Purple Grizzly, Unit HD, Golden Astro these people are freaking great commentators, but they and they work hard, but they don't get anywhere. And, it, and then you see the big guys flaunt what they have, and then it just lowers your self-esteem down. And you know it's kind of hard as a small YouTuber, not just me, but other people, to get somewhere in this community. You know the community is an amazing community. It's just a lot of hard work, a lot of hard effort. I'm upset, Cuban, and peace. Thoughts are not modest, but big dreams seem to seem to my wattage. So bright the beams.
in my cottage at home with the hundred watts that don't dodge it. Pro libertate compadre, we need freedom all day and always.